The most common keyboard press is now tab, the tab key for completing from an AI suggestion. It is, we're, we're in a new world now. It's all, all different. Now we don't have to barely write. And the only key on the keyboard is gonna be this tab key here that we really need the whole time. I can see in the future, we're just gonna have a giant tab key, just one giant tab key. Uh, the AI can complete all of our coding tasks for us for the most part, if not completely entirely. Like for example, let's let's give this a shot. Let's go over here to our code editor and start from a blank screen. So what we wanna do is create a main function and it immediately goes into a hello world. That's great. Uh, but say I wanna define a function that says add two numbers. So a, a function, a uh, function here, and then it should auto, yep, it automatically it takes care of that for me. And also I want to um, say, I wanna write tests for that. So let's do like something like this and then it will auto complete. Uh, I just tabbed again. Oh, here's another one, I tabbed again. Perfect, all right, there we go. And clean up some of the stuff there and then say this is not enough testing. I wanna do more testing, right? This line, this line of code right here is just not enough. So I can clone, I can, um, I can just have the AI come up with another idea. There would be something simple like that. And then maybe even another idea, right? We wanna keep going. And then what if I wanna fill in some numbers and say like 10, oh, let's, do, let's try this. Let's see if the AI can complete this. I have 14. <laughs> I did, I'm just pressing tab this whole time and it's covering a lot of test cases for us here. Uh, and now say I want to actually use this code in my, yep, call at, well, let's say define two numbers and add them. All right, let's see, let's see the AI. Oh, got the first line, got the second line. We're gonna add them together and then we're gonna print out the result. I just pressed tab for every single line. It's, it's ridiculous, it's a whole new world. And here, like usually in VS code, you'll have IntelliSense, right? Where it knows what the definitions of the functions are. So it says it needs an integer and an integer and what to fill in. Well, with this, I don't even have to worry about that. I don't even have to discern anything. It automatically fills it in complete to the end of the line. This is so much a better way to build software, I is the, the tab is the new keyboard key that we will all be using more than any other key. Also, just to try if you're if you're still if you're still watching, then let's try out actually compiling just to make sure this compiles. So we say Rust C main .rs, and then it compiles. So then we should just be able to say dot forward slash main, and it prints out. Perfect. That's exactly. <laughs> now I know this is really simple and straightforward from a demo perspective, it will do all the things that you want for the more advanced functions as well, especially if there's one use case, that just one that you would want for code completion with the AI, it's just writing tests for you. Just have it write all the tests for you.